Hey guys, this is like a cool man or something. My name is Kikuru. This is a redo of uh, one of my videos. If you haven't read the title, and uh, sorry about the quality. Reason being, uh, I'm using one my Mandy cam full webcam. Basically, same camera, same stuff. Just the quality is gonna be distorted because I'm using quick. Reason B, because uh, if you haven't seen the title, it's how to screen cap quick screen capture on YouTube. And uh, I did this earlier, but my audio is cutting out, and I'm guessing it was because I think I plugged my mic in too late before the quick capture even recognized it. So I'm not sure if it picked it up. So uh, I also moved the webcam so the uh, STX is like, it's only like about this far. As you see, it's really close, so it can recognize this microphone and that microphone. So it gets uh, pretty decent audio and doesn't cut out. Anyways, guys, I've been having problems with the quick capture. But uh, I thought I should make this video anyway, just to help out some of those who like to use it. You know, it's not a bad tool, just that they could adjust audio and uh, quality settings on it. And even though it's a quick capture, make it maybe a little enhanced. But anyway, uh, that's not why I'm here today. Well, anyway, if you installed Manicam, or if you have Cam Twist, I think, or Colloquy, it's either one of those for the Mac, or uh, Webcam Max, or anything like that, and you wanted to know how to quick screen capture, basically how to screen capture without like uploading it through YouTube Uploader, which takes forever sometimes, or even uploading it through something like Firefox Universal Uploader, which also takes a while, but you know, if you want to upload it pretty quick with, uh, I guess it's decent quality, good enough, the Mandycam's quality is great, I guess it uses Cam Studio, I'm not sure it has a built-in screen capture, which is also really good, uh, Mandycam's only 12.1 megabytes, I believe. And, uh, great quality, I'm just not sure if, uh, quick capture, it being like it is, will distort the quality, so I have to check it out. So anyways, guys, uh, this is how you do it. First off, you're gonna wanna <laughs> go to your webcam and make sure you have Manicam Virtual Cam selected. After that, select your microphone, and if you have Manicam or whatever you want selected, like, uh, it has to be a, a program, just like I said, uh, Manicam, uh, uh, what do you call that? Manicam, Webcam Max, whatever it may be. Okay, so I open up Manicam, and I go to Sources, and I go to s Desktop, and I say Partial Desktop, bang, instantly switched. And as you see there, I just went to my desktop, and Quick Capture window, and since it's using my Manicam program, it's recognizing it on Screen Capture. Now you're probably getting a weird loop there, but anyway. It's decent quality. I don't know how it's going to turn out on YouTube, though. For, oh, look, the way I'm looking at it, it's actually really good quality, guys. And, you know, it works fine, and it'll be a great way just to do a quick tutorial and upload it quick. And I can upload so many more tutorials this way. Uh, just that, you know, the quality and audio. I'm not probably going to do it. I'm probably just going to stick to you know. But if I ever have a quick tutorial, I'll use this most of the time. And I can do this, just... Let's say uh, I don't want to do this anymore. I can just switch back to my camera. And you can do this on a live stream on Ustream or just in TV. Back to your stream. So anyways, guys, uh, hope you uh, enjoy this quick, really quick tutorial on how to do that on YouTube. Uh, sorry if the quality turned out a little bad or something like that. You know, okay, again, I'm using Quick Capture. I don't really like to use it, but for this instance, it's actually pretty useful. So if you want a quick screen capture, and, and um, I've tried it before. When you hit Finish and Exit, it uploads really fast, guys. So anyways, uh, sorry, uh, hold Sony, I know you commented, I hate to do that when I have to delete the video when people commented already and rated, but, uh, I had to do it rather than, uh, you know, getting bad ratings for other people because of the, the sound blanking off. Hopefully you won't do that this time, guys, uh, anyways, hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and, uh, that's about it, and, uh, thanks for watching, I hope this tutorial helped you out, please, uh, help out Tech World, uh, by, uh, rating my video, commenting on my videos, and if you can, please subscribe to the channel which should be up here to your right orange button please cl uh if you really like my videos please click it <laughs> you know anyways guys thanks for watching and uh stay tuned for more videos on youtube you know tips and tricks anyways thanks for watching